What's up, everybody? I'm here again, Javier Payano, bringing you Gone Home Console Edition. Finally, the game has come to Xbox One. Um, I've been waiting for this game for quite some time, and we're going to have a lot of fun here today uh, solving this mystery together. So here we go. This game takes place, uh, I believe it's 1995. Um, so she gets home, her family's not home, and there's you know no cell phones, no way for her to call. She just has to search through the house and kind of put the pieces together of what happened to her family. Hi, Mom. Uh, so I got my ticket home from Europe. I get back on June 6th, but it's a really late flight because that was the cheapest, so it gets in at midnight. But don't worry, I'll get a shuttle from the airport so you don't have to pick me up. Like, really seriously, you don't have to. Okay, so, love you. See you soon. Bye. Thanks for the host, T. Wow, it's so great to be playing again. Yep, June 7th, 1995. Oh, wow. That's amazing. So we are in the entrance. See, the door is locked, so we cannot possibly leave. And here's our luggage. Caitlin Greenbrier. So you're playing as Caitlyn right now. I am playing as Caitlyn. So let's see what's going on here. Whoa. Don't be worried. I'm already worried. Okay. Hey, what's up, Sharky? Thank you so much for joining. Thank you for hosting. Wow, that's awesome. Appreciate it. All right, so I'm looking for a key. I thought it would be down here. Okay, so I'm crouched now. First puzzle solved. Hey, and uh, left bumper for the contents of my backpack. Awesome. Oh, here we go, baby. Here we go. We're in. Oh, wow. Gone home, console edition. Start picking up the clues here. Terran scream Briar, so that's dad. Dear Katie, so much has changed. 
Even just since you've been away. We moved into this house. Wow. I'm in a new school. And my big sister being gone for a year doesn't make it any easier. It doesn't feel real. But I'm not gonna let it phase me. I used to tell you everything. And if I can't do it in person, because you're all I'll tell it to this journal. Just like I was talking to you. Wow, okay, so there's the first dialogue. First journal entry, should I say, by my little sister Sam. So we're trying to figure out what is happening here. What have what have you done? What have you done with my family? Author magazine. So Terrence Greenbrier, my father is an author. I'm just gonna dump everything in the front room. Ooh, hello. <laughs> Thank you so much for joining me, everybody. Wow, this is awesome. Gilbster, hello, how's it going? Yeah, I've played through it already once before on Mac. So they were planning on coming to get me from the airport. Something happened. Looks like the last place I visited was Amsterdam. Uh, this game is very tense. It's not necessarily scary, I would say, but it does have kind of some kind of mysterious element going on. You're not sure what happened to your family, and it is raining and thundering, and there's creepy music, so yeah, for sure. Um, let's see. How old is Caitlin? She was born in 73, and it's 1995 right now. Okay, I could spin things around and, and look at them. That's pretty cool. <laughs> yeah, it could get spooky. That's me up there, Caitlin, and this is Sam. She's the one the story revolves around. Oh, God. Okay, so I can press Y to check the map. Okay, I'm in the purple shaded area. I think she's in in college, college age. <laughs> Everything's crossed out except for positive attitude. Oh my god, you are so lucky you finished high school before we moved into this house. So, it's the first day of school, and there I am, introducing myself to the class. And I say that I just moved into the house on Arbor Hill. All of a sudden, every kid in the room turns and just stares like I suddenly transformed into a mutant. I just stood there, wishing pretty hard for a rewind button. Because now maybe nobody knows my name. But they all know who I am. The Psycho House Girl. <sighs> Great. Alright, so there's our second piece of dialogue there from Sam. Great uh, voice actress behind that character. Starting high school. Guess it's not going so well. Um, okay, this looks like a study.
Hmm. Okay. So, I'll be able to find that combination somewhere. Yeah, thank you so much everybody for joining the stream. It's been an awesome uh, couple of days. We were able to hang out together at the Twitch meetup yesterday at Ignite Cafe, video game cafe. That was so much fun meeting a bunch of cool streamers. So if you were there, shout out to you. Terrence Greenbrier. Huh. So something's not right with the house. Uh, DJ, I've, uh, you know, I, th Ignite used to be by my old high school, by Lane Tech High School. And I used to go there all the time when I was in high school, but I had never been there since. And I think that's, they've, I don't know how long that Ignite has been there, or if there were two, if they just moved. But that was my first time at the new Ignite. So, yeah, it was my first time there, and it was pretty cool. I really enjoyed it. All right, the male gaze, how to subvert it. Okay. So it's good to turn all the lamps on because then you kind of can tell where you've been before. I see you. You can't hide from me, you note. Huh. All right, check the map real quick. Okay, cool. All right, there's a couple doors over there. Thank you so much for joining me, everybody. You guys are amazing. I was checking out some of your streams earlier. Sharky's Hood, I was checking you out, playing some... Uh, you are playing some Tom Clancy there. That was a lot of fun. I love your reactions. <laughs> Ooh, someone likes the X-Files. Hey. Labyrinth. Oh, Labyrinth. David Bowie. This is a severe weather. This is probably messy for them, actually. <laughs> yeah, I remember the old Belmont Western location. But I've never been to the new one until yesterday. It was great. all windows and doors. Flood conditions are expected at lower elevations. Oh. Where's my David Bowie video game already, huh? Oops, I can't even read this. Where's the light? Oops. You know that feeling? Where the first moment you see someone, it's like they have a big gold star around them, and you have to get to know them. Well, there's this girl. I think she's oh. a senior. She's usually dressed kind of punk, but sometimes I see her in this, like, army uniform. And she's always drawing in this notebook, looking so intense. I had no idea how I would ever, like, have an excuse to talk to her. Foolish. Until I noticed she and her friends hang out and play Street Fighter at the 7-Eleven every day after school. Oh yeah, Street Fighter. We're in, that's an in. We've got it. All right, so um, so she set eyes on her romantic interest. The story's starting to cook a little bit. Foolish, what's up, man? I was checking you out playing this morning. 
Thanks for your stream. It was really great. Everybody should go follow Foolish because this guy is awesome. You were seriously so entertaining during your stream, for real. Airplane! I remember uh, recording uh, Michael Jackson live off of MTV on VHS. This is all resonating hard. Yeah, Street Fighter bringing the people together. And what is the name of this band? I forgot. Sorry, can I look at this real quick? Girl Scout? Role Model. Okay, I don't know if that's the name of the band or not. But there's a specific band that they use throughout this game. Haha, <laughs> foolish. Oh, there's a door here somewhere. Oh, there it is. Oh, Girl Scout is the name of the band. Thank you, Glibster. Gilbster. Gilbster. Whoa, they rock. Captain Allegra. So Allegra, or Allegra means happy, right? So I think I need to find more pieces of that um, story. Crumpled up note. Wow, remember passing notes in class? Oh boy. Wow, okay. You see where see where they're going there. They think the whole family's crazy. What's this? Uh National Rainforestry, so um Caitlin's mom, the mom of the family, is a forest ranger. So that's where that comes in. Oh, snap, DJ. Okay, I haven't been in here before. There's a light. More light. Let there be light. Spooky music. Uh-oh. Huh. When you live in one place your whole life, your next door neighbor is kind of like your default friend. And Daniel only got weirder over the years. So moving away has been a good excuse to, like, not see him anymore. But he did always have the good Nintendo games. <laughs> Maybe I'll give him a call. Convenient friend. Dang. Who had that friend growing up, huh? It's like, uh, you're okay, but you got a Nintendo. Yeah, so these are these are the books that Terrence Greenbrier wrote, the father. Unfortunately, they were not 
success as successful as he would have hoped. Yeah! Shot, 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 shot. Let's get all the alcohol out here. No, you can't drink in this game, just FYI. Ooh, record. Somehow I always knew that someday Ooh. you would see through. Who's that? Now that it's happened, I guess somebody shazam this. Oh my god, what is this? <laughs> Can't get you off my mind. What am I going to do? Voodoo, mildew, and chandu. Why, Daddy, I didn't know you were I'm right here looking at you, honey. If it ain't me, it's my shadow. <laughs> wow, she is creative. I ain't been nowhere. From me. Ella, that's what I thought too, but I wasn't sure. I usually hear her singing in French. Dave Brubeck, yeah, this is the guy who composed Take Five. I wish you had a weed for me. Okay, where am I? oh, the music room, nice. And I went into the closet. Now I'm going where? Now I'm in the hallway. There's one more door back here that I missed. Or haven't gotten to yet. Hyah! Where's my family? <laughs> I'll tell them when I find them. Oh god. Okay, here we go, yo. What's in the attic? I seem to have hit a dead end here. Okay. That's locked. Okay, there's a whole other side of the house on that over there. So let's check that out. What's in the attic? So dark and creepy. Let me get some lights on over here. Jealous yet? Mom's friend. How many phone books do we need in one house? No. This. Give me that. This. Nothing there. Okay. It's just gonna be, you know, open drawers and cabinets and everything everywhere. Trapped in cabinets, trapped in cabinet cabinets. Can you get out? Of course you can. Rug? I'm looking for a key under a rug. That seems like something someone would do. Alright, let's go upstairs then. Jeez. 
It's like they know when you're going to like a new area, you know? And, and, okay, thunder now. Oh yeah, see there she goes, Janice Greenbrier. She's a park ranger. So they're trying to do um, controlled burning operations. This way they can control the burning instead of having it go haywire out of their control. Cooking class. Yes, lights, thank you. Was this a cassette? Oh, it's a cassette uh, case. This is so punky, you know, like, just like ride the, the song titles out. Bratmobile, that was the other band I was thinking of. Bratmobile. Our, oh, okay, I think this is Sam's room here. Hahaha. <laughs> That's funny. Stop leading, leaving all the lights on. She's 17 years old, Samantha. Oh, uh, yeah. Looks like they don't let her go out much. Ooh, here it's we go. It's weird hanging out with girls. Daniel was around ever since I was little. And other girls? I don't know. But being around Lonnie is like Lonnie. instantly just right. Yes. I gave her the grand Psycho House tour and took my revenge on Super Nintendo. Ooh. And it was like, I don't know, I finally found someone I feel normal around. I drove her home and she gave me this tape and said, you have got to listen to this. I haven't stopped playing it since. All right, so you know she took the Nintendo. Journey of the Crystal and Spitfire. Interesting thing. Oh, there's one more over here. Adventurous the Cat. Returns. So, a quick thing about Spitfire. I heard an uh, interview with Steve Gaynor. If you play Minerva's Den, there is a section of... Minerva's Den where you can go and that's the the Bioshock 2 DLC pack story campaign and you can play like the original Spitfire I think it is on uh, it's probably an Atari or something like that I never I never got to that part in Bioshock um, but they uh, Steve Gaynor put Super Spitfire in here to connect the two universes of Gone Home and Bioshock so this technically takes place in the universe of Bioshock, which is pretty cool. Hey, Ash, you are just in time to listen to some more Bratmobile, though. So this is what Lonnie just gave to Sam in the story. Yeah. Oh yeah, this game has an amazing soundtrack. Oh, here's a continuation of that story. Labyrinth. I'm gonna have to go see the Labyrinth tonight. Oh 
Oh, <laughs> aim you. What's up? So good to see you. How you doing? Thank you so much for joining us. Grab your number. Are you going to the dance with anyone? Who's got a crush on you? Wow. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, pages on their beepers, y'all. Oh, boy. Next page. <laughs> wow. Oh god. What's that combo? Gotta find that combo. Oh, awesome. Please do. <laughs> you sexy motherfucker! Yeah, it's really, it's really, uh, yeah, it's nostalgic sec playing it the second time for sure. I think it's nostalgic playing it the first time. So look at this! Oh man, this just had. I think this was in '94, wasn't it? Yeah, you know what? I used my um. Oop, what was that? Oh, yeah. Yeah. Wow, everybody. Thank you so much for joining me and for all the hosts. This is awesome. It's getting crowded in here. Yeah, thank you for the for the tip. You know what? I actually do use um I use my Connect on my Xbox One as a cam. But this is such a visual game, you know, that I think that for this time and you know, it's a special game. It's first person and you know, there's a lot of detail. So I think for this one it was appropriate to to just let the game shine. Uh, uh, I usually have my webcam on, my webcam on when I'm playing other games, though. So, don't worry. <laughs> hey, potato salad needs potatoes. You have a great name, you do right there. <laughs> Thanks for joining us. Oh yeah, thank you so much. I you know I try to do that. That's what it's all about. Uh, us hanging out together and chatting. I love it. Thanks for the tips. I really really appreciate that.
<laughs> oh god. Oh god. What what is this? What is this? Oh my god, you guys are going to make me turn my webcam on like right now. <laughs> Halfway through. Oh, is it broken, eh? Does that mean something's over there? Hmm. <laughs> this game is called Gone Home. It's uh it's a short game. It's about it took me 3 hours when I played it on Steam. Um so it's quite short. Um it's all about exploration. I have come home. I've gone home. After a year of studying abroad, and I I come home to an empty house, and I have no idea where my family is, and I'm just like looking around the house, trying to find any clue that will help me figure out where they are, you know. And you're picking up different objects and and you know diary pages, and it will play a voiceover of your little sister, and she kind of tells you story, piece by piece by piece. I just saw a condom in that drawer, and this is my parents' bedroom. Gross. Ew. Yuck. The holy, b holy Bible. London. Oh, okay. So these are postcards from me. Yeah, I. They're. Uh. They're. Uh. So I got a note somewhere that said, don't look in the addict. So I'm wondering, like, what is what is happening in that addict? Butch Cassidy. Well, okay, looks like someone left in a hurry. Some kind of emergency. Omitin. You can't hide from me. I can't go in the attic because... Well, I haven't found it yet. But also, it's probably locked or something. Oh, Rick. Who's Rick? Wait a hard minute. Who is Rick? Ooh, the plot thickens. Jan. Is it Jan or Jen? I forget. Carol. So this is mom's friend Carol. <laughs> I threw the Bible on the bed actually, Ash. <laughs> gotta gotta go to the addict. Thank you so much for joining me, everybody. This is amazing. And everyone who was at the, the meet and greet yesterday, that was, that was so cool. So wonderful to meet amazing people like AIM. Everyone follow AIM. She's an awesome streamer. And, uh, and Foolish, you want me to use a camera. I didn't see you using a camera this morning when I was watching your stream. <laughs> are you gonna say nah right now? Are you are you gnawing me right now? Are you gonna gnaw here? Yeah, that was awesome. Yeah, man, that guy. He's telling us all about these mods and all this stuff. Like he's smart. 
That's why I can't do PC gaming. Too much craziness. I tried though. I tried to do some PC gaming. Actually, Gone Home was one of the big reasons I started uh, actually getting into PC gaming on my Mac, at the very least. Alright, I don't see anything in here. Let's see what the map says. Huh. Something in here should have triggered a dialogue entry. None of these opened? Trash can. No. Oh, yeah. Yeah, it was a good venue. I liked it there a lot. What's in mom's purse? Can't get in there. I checked all of this. Oh god! What is that? Whoa, creepy. Where's that outlet? Where is it? I'm out of here. You can use my room if you want. I won't be needing it anymore. What the hell does that mean, Sam? Oh, Jesus. So this is the guest room. I'll turn the lamp on first so I can actually read. Oh, okay. <laughs> Lonnie is so cool. Sam. Yeah. Wisconsin hype. Okay, here we go, people. Some ghosts. Here's like where the ghostly things start to come in. This is why I thought the game was 94 before, because, it, you know, these dates take place in 94. <laughs> Whoa, ghosts? Whoa, what is happening in the chat right now? <laughs> I, I, I'm... <laughs> I look away for a second to read a note, and this is what's going on here. Wow. That's worth a nine hour round trip, right, AIM? <laughs> oh boy. And now we found the real reason the meetup was so much fun. Alright, anything else in here? 
Okay, where else do I need to go? Ooh, okay, here we go, people. This is the addict. Uh, I don't want to go yet. I'm not going yet. I'm scared. Oh my god, I'm getting nervous already in this game. <laughs> Speechless! <laughs> it wouldn't be the first time. <laughs> it's getting hot in here. You know what? I was standing <laughs> in the. I was standing uh, awkwardly for a little while, just a little while, at the meet and greet. Like, uh, what? What do I do here? It was like, it was like that first time you walk into the lunchroom, you don't know who to sit with. And aim few was there. Came, came to my rescue, so thank you for saying hello, and we started having a chat, and it was really fun after that, so I really appreciated that. It was awesome. Much love. Okay, Halloween show. The Misfits. Stegen Lounge. Uh, I doubt that my parents will let me go to that, Sam most definitely said, or thought. Sometimes you just have to lie to mom and dad. Like when Lonnie asked me to see a band with her and stay over at her friend's place in the city after. That's a lie to mom and dad's situation. It was so <laughs> worth it. The girls on stage were just so loud and real and awesome. And everybody was moving together like one huge tide of sound. Between two songs, Lonnie leaned over and said, how do you like your first show? I was so happy. I felt tears starting in my eyes. Aww. And then she up and hugged me. I think she could tell. Oh, That's so beautiful. That's incredible. I, I think this is the point at, when I was playing the game the first time. I was just like, oh my god, this game is going to do me in. Uh, I did not ignore the love announcement. Much love. So much of the love. There's o nothing but love here. All right. Uh, we don't know what exactly happened, but obviously that will have some kind of effect on the story that, you know, the fact that she's falling in love with a girl. Um, so there's something going on there. Ooh, found another cassette. This one says, Heavens to Betsy. Yes, this is a, another of the bands I remember. So what I'm going to do real quick, because that looks scary. I'm not going there yet. It's too soon. It's just too soon. I can't do it. It's too much. Oh. Over here. Let's listen to this track. So much excitement, so much love. Oh yeah. Yeah, that's the addict. All right, I'm going. This is gonna be my intro music into the addict. You ready? Just do it. Don't let dreams be dreams. No, she. Yeah, she's never played this game. All right. Oh, that was a hard fade out. Okay, let's see. Oh, there's the addict. I'm scared, you guys. You guys and gals. What's gonna happen? I can't enter if the red light on. Sorry, y'all. Can't go in there. Oh, and it's locked. 
Don't let dreams be dreams. Well, I have a new dream of finding the key to this door. Okay. What do I do? <laughs> it's locked. No. Oh, this song rocks. Big Joni, huh? Oh, yeah, I want to check that out. Because, Inda, you have incredible musical taste. So, I'll listen to anything you tell me to listen to. All right. Um. Okay, so that's not working. Anything down here? We'll see. Thank you so much for joining me, everybody. Everyone following, everyone hosting. I really appreciate that. I'm having such a blast with y'all already. I'm, like, nervous. I've played this game already. I'm still, like, nervous right now with this game. All right, we got to figure out what we're doing now. Let's see if we can... Let, let's just go downstairs and see what else there is downstairs. Wow, you guys, thank you so much for joining me. This is amazing. I can't believe I hadn't opened this door earlier. All right, so, yep, Janice, Screenbriar, that's mom. So, I guess she's not at work because her work ID is here. That's a pretty good guess. Oh, I love that girl punk. I'm all about that. Yeah, I can't wait for Record. Record is looking amazing. I cannot wait to play that game. It's going to be a big exclusive. Really big. Ah! There's that socket. Nope, nothing there. Okay, here's where I start freaking out because I don't know what to do next. <laughs> Woo. Oh, I will for sure. Oh, thanks, Uncle Harvey. Couldn't put any more thought into it. Yeah, the problem with me, AIM, is um, I'm on Xbox One. And I signed up for Twitch alerts. I don't know if maybe it doesn't work for Xbox One or if I'm just not doing it right. But I can't get it, I can't seem to get it going, so I might need someone's help with that, maybe. Yeah, I didn't think it worked for Xbox One either. No. Yeah, so it's where it's PC only, right? OBS is PC only. Or Twitch alerts is PC only. That's why I was so interested with the thing at the meetup yesterday. What was it? Um <laughs> it's the thing I couldn't pronounce. ISO scene or something like that. And they said that it was going to be able to be used on Xbox One, so that, that kind of got me excited.
Infinicine. Infinicine. Yeah, that's what it was. Mm, I already got everything down here. No more locked doors. Yeah, that's what I want. Just so just anything would be great. Cause right now, you know, I kind of have to. I haven't been doing a good job of it this stream, but you know, I usually clicked on the viewer list, and that way I can shout people out. Heaven in the shadow. Are there keys in the dresser to unlock the attic? Yeah, you know what? I need to remember to just leave things open. I'm just going to leave everything open to know that I searched there. What's with all the three ring binders? Get out of here. Crumpled paper. I just want to say, yo, man, yo, man. <laughs> I don't remember a crowbar being in here. Yeah, I'm, I'm trashing this. I'm pissed off, man. They were supposed to pick me up. Sam. Sam. Ooh. Hello. Sam. Well, I think I know who that was. Where are you? Oh my god. Really? I need to talk to you. Please be there. Oh, oh my god. Hi, Mom. Uh, so I got my ticket home from Europe. I get back on June 6th, but it's a really late flight because that was the cheapest, so it gets in at midnight. But don't worry, I'll get a shuttle from the airport so you don't have to pick me up. Like, really seriously, you don't have to. Okay, so, love you. See you soon. Bye. Yeah, I like to have the subtitles on always. And I guess this is a tip for all streamers. But, you know, they're, for the population of people who are hearing impaired, it's really nice to have subtitles on. I wish there was an option for me to have auto subtitles on because like this time I completely forgot to turn them on at the beginning of the game. I'm all about subtitles. All right, let's see here. You know what, the locker. God, there's gotta be that combination somewhere. Where that combo at? I just wanna say your man, your man. I should be able to kick it in for sure. <laughs> hey, hey. K Dig, how you doing? Oh, so good to see you. Thank you for joining the stream. So glad you're here.
1965. Could that be the combination? That was it, right? 1965? I know it's four digits. Oh, what am I doing? Ow. Nope. There weren't any numbers in here. Oh. Trapper Keeper. Another Bible. Well, there's only one place for this. Nineteen ninety four, possibly, yeah, that's the that's the last year in, in this. So let's try that. Nineteen ninety four. Nope. This year is 1995. That didn't work either. Oh, hey, Matrix. How's it going? Thank you for joining us. See, this is the real creepness right here. What is this all about? What happened here? Something happened in this room. And this is broken. I don't like that. What's there? Oh, of course. Of course. K dig. Yeah, that's what, you know, all. all all in a day's work, just trying to get into this teenage girl's locker, you know what I'm saying? What she got in there? It's my sister. I gotta figure out what's going on here. Where's my family? Four digits. Oh, there's this guy Richard again. Y'all see this? Do you see what's happening here? So Richard was the one who wrote Janice a note saying, oh... Blah, blah, blah. So nice to get to know you. And Richard gave Janice all fives on her review. I don't care how great. I don't care how great a worker you are. You don't get all fives. Something fishy happen is happening there. How about 1029? Could that be the combination? That was the date of the show. 1029. That could be the combo. Somebody remember that. I'm coming back to the room in a little bit. Wow. Thank you all so much for being here. This is amazing. Incredible. Thank you for all the people following, all the people hosting. That's awesome. I promise I will try to get some kind of alerts going here because I do need that. I've been trying really hard actually to get that going. It's not been working out for me. I need to get something at least in the browser, right T you said? 
Yeah, that 30 viewer hype. Or all fives, but there were five fives and I only need a five digit number. I mean a four digit number. But let me try 1029 and I'll try all fives through. Oh God. It's thunder and lightning. All right, what am I trying first? 1029, right? Nine. Oh, Mr. G. Welcome to Mr. G's room, G's room, G's room. Mr. G, thank you so much for being here. Yes, thank you. Wonderful to meet you. Awesome. Thank you for spreading the word. I really appreciate that. Wow. So cool. Oh, that music, though. You hear that? Am I getting close to something? They're trying to tell me that? God bless it all. All right, let's see who's on here. Um, okay. Oh. Emelise. Please tell me if I'm saying your name correct. Emelise, thank you so much for joining the stream. This is awesome. Thank you. Yay. Oh, wow. Kate. Kate Dig, you just bring in all your peeps over here, aren't you? Wow. Okay, all fives this time. Katie, I really appreciate it. You're so awesome. Thank you so much. It's like it's it's like the Shy Town crew in here right now. Oh god, I got it on the first try. Awesome. Nice to meet you too. Thank you. Yeah, yeah. Definitely do that. Oh my god, so much love. <laughs> oh, I can't take it. Too much love. Oh, there's so much beauty in the world, I can't even handle it sometimes. Wow. Yeah, you do, you did say that. Oh, Ash, we wish you would have been there. It was an amazing time. Wish you had been there. We already tried 1995, so I know that's not going to work. You'd think it'd be something in this room. Alright, I'm just trying to sock it. Dang. That didn't work. Wow, I really don't know, y'all. And I played this game already. Alright, so I went to Sam's room. La -da 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 -da. Oh, this is hair dye. I'm freaking out of here. It's hair dye, y'all. It's okay. No one no one got murdered in this bedroom. A uh, bathroom. <gasps> Lonnie brought oh. hair dye over today. There it is. She said, I need to fix these roots. Think you could help. Ritz. Dying hair is weirdly intimate. I don't know if I've touched someone else's scalp before. That's pretty intimate, right? It felt intimate. I, I was trying to a few together after, aim few. and I expected her to say something about how it looked crappy or good or whatever. But that's when she said, "You're so beautiful." Oh. And she was looking at me. Right in that moment, I wanted to say something but I waited and the moment was gone oh my god oh my god oh my god that's incredible oh so much so much so many feels so many feels Lonnie and Sam it's so beautiful this uh, game, I'm so happy you are all joining me for this game today. This is a very important game. And I hope you all, you know, fall in love with it as we're playing it together. And, and you can go check it out for yourselves. It's different. It's not like other games. It ain't no, it ain't no Dark Souls. You know what I'm saying? 
Beautiful, though. Okay, there's gotta be something here. Tell me something good. Did I even come in here? Up. Oh. oh no, that was something else. Up. Oh. oh. How many times did I walk past this folder, y'all? Closet. There's a secret passage in between the closet and the library. Who's incredible? You? Aim, you're incredible? I knew that. Wow, yeah, you should support the owner. These guys are amazing. Uh, Fulbright is the name of the game. They're coming out with a new game called Tacoma. It's going to be on PC and Xbox One. That one is pretty much the same concept, but in space. So look up, look forward to that. But yeah, so great, so great. Emily's got that follow hype is real. I can't even, the, my, my text is scrolling down so fast right now. I feel like I'm big time right now. <laughs> All right, where am, I go where am I going here? Oh. Someone said Dark Souls. I know a bunch of you in here like Dark Souls, so. All right, where's the claws? This is down. Oh, okay, I see where I need to go now. I see where I need to go now. I may not be going the right way, but I see where I need to go. Um. Nope. Wrong one. Is it here? Nope. Also the wrong one. Wait, where the heck do I? Oh, oh, I gotta go downstairs. I'm sorry. I gotta go downstairs first. All right, now what? Wow, this is everybody follow each other, okay? Let's do that. How about we do that? Yes, okay, now I'm going in the correct direction. Ah. Uh, <laughs> Thanks, aim. <laughs> you gotta check every little thing in this in this game. You can't miss anything. You saw I, I walked by that folder so many times. I thought it was a poster. That's why I didn't even do anything to it. Okay, something is here. <gasps> oh, you guys. Um, okay, so, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my goodness, gracious, goodness, okay, here we go, here we gizzo, okay, so, okay, so there's a couple of loose board spots, let's see if those automatically pop up, I think they pop up, yeah, I see that there. Wow, this is amazing. Do I keep going up? My character, uh, I think, took a cab home. Um, took a cab home from the airport. Okay, so now I'm back in mom and dad's room up here now. So I'm going to go by Sam's room to hit that floorboard up over there. Wow, this is incredible. Now the game's cooking. One of these. Up. Oh. Oh, baby. It's Ouija time. Okay, this is freaking me out already. Shit's getting real for sure. That's for sure. Oh my god. <laughs> 
Oh, okay. I could tell that they got freaked out and couldn't even finish this. That is... I'm... I'm getting goosebumps right now. What do I do with this? Property? Oh! Oh! The c piece of the combo now I got. Oh man, okay. Zero is the first number. Are you done? <laughs> Are you lurking now? <laughs> okay, we're not doing the Ouija board. Don't, 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 mm. don't get twisted about, th we're not doing that. I'm running away from the Ouija board now, but isn't this kind of scary here with these hidden passageways here? What is this? What's it all about? I don't know how to love him. I don't know why he moves me. Okay, here and to the left, so one floorboard or one panel here should be loose. Oh, no. Too far. Here. There's that Javier nade for you. <laughs> Cause I know you love it. Oh. Okay, I just walked through that door, so it should be in this back corner here. Yes. Yes, there's the misfits. Uh, by the way, totally love the misfits. We were talking about punk music earlier, yeah? At Todd's brother's place after the show, there was only a futon to sleep on, so Lonnie and I shared it. The lights went out. I was turned toward her, my eyes started to adjust, and then I could see she was looking at me, too. In the dark, she smiled. Oh. My heart was beating so fast. I rolled over. I felt so, I don't know, nervous? After a minute, she put her arm around me and was so close and whispered in my ear, I really like you. I just nodded my head and I really hope she could tell. I really hope that she meant what I think she did. I felt like a shook up can of soda ever since. I hope we have the chance to talk before I explode. Oh my god. <laughs> Suddenly, I am glad I didn't have the webcam on. You guys, I'm crying already with this game. Oh my god. <laughs> it's too much. It's just too much. You guys, love is love. Like I don't even, I don't understand. You're gonna tell someone else that who they can and can't love it. It doesn't make sense to me, and it will always hurt me personally when people don't get to be themselves. I can't, I can't deal with that. That's not okay. <laughs> Tags. Wow. It's just the words, the voice acting, and the music, everything together is incredible I can't uh. all right well let's go open this locker y'all maybe there'll be a key here what do you think 
Uh, tags, uh, by the way, I followed you, so thank you so much for joining the stream. I really appreciate it. <laughs> oh, I made you pop out for a bit, didn't I? All right, let's check this out. <clears throat> zero, five, zero, one. Oh, and what does it say there? Property of Sam, private. Sorry, Sam, I got to figure out what's going on. Here we go. Who's ready for this? Ooh, oh, oh, hello. Okay. <laughs> I love the, the subtitles there. Caitlin said, gosh, Sam. But she's also finding out that her sister is gay for the first time, too. Oh, look, it's Lonnie. Wow. Lonnie came over today, but everything was different. She was sitting at my desk chair, and she wouldn't look at me. Finally, I asked her what was going on. She said she felt like she'd done something wrong that night in the city. Like I must think... But I said no. There was nothing wrong. I just wanted to say... But I couldn't find the words. I felt like I was gonna cry, but I wasn't sad. She got up and sat next to me on the bed. I looked at her. Lonnie... Do you think you could ever... And that's when she kissed me. <laughs> wow. <laughs> yeah, that's Lonnie with the red hair that they dyed together. Wow. You hear this music, people? Oh my god. Oh my god. Alright, let's see what's down here now. Some potato chips. Wow. Oh. All right. So things about to get real again. Spam love. Everybody spam love in the comments right now. You better spam that love. Can you feel the love tonight? Tonight. Oh, hello. Oh, this is the same worksheet that Sam did. I got a check plus though. <laughs> so much lerve. <laughs> Oops, wait. Oh. Thank you so much for hanging out with me, everybody. This has been one of my favorite streams ever, I think. Sorry if I get a little too overly emotional. I know that was a complaint a second ago. <laughs> That's just me, though. I don't want to be cool. I ain't trying to be cool. So how creepy is this right now? Pretty, pretty, uh, pretty creepy. Oh, 
Oh, cool. So Samantha got into Reed College. Summer program. Okay, it's a summer program. Creative writing. I'm so stupid sometimes. I was telling Lonnie that I got into my college summer program thing. And I was all making plans like, you should come visit me, stay in my dorm room. But she said, Sam, I ship out on June 6th. Oh, God. I was like, ship out? To where? She said, to basic training. What did you think I was doing all that ROTC stuff for? I guess she's been planning to join the army right after high school since she was like 12. And I guess she's really going to do it. So I was like, after graduation, I'm just never going to see you again? She said, let's just have fun while we can. Oh, God. <laughs> Aw, love you too, Aim. Thank you so much. Yeah, okay, so y'all now y'all see this is the problem here is that Lonnie's moving away, she's going to basic training, so they don't have a lot of time together. Man, you know, you finally meet someone who uh who understands you, I guess, and they have to go away then. Ugh. Sucks. Where am I going? <clears throat> Oh god. So Richard Breyer is actually the grandfather and Terence is the father. So Richard Breyer is a successful Ooh, oh hello. Cassette. Where's that player? Here. So, Richard Breyer is actually very successful, unlike Terrence, so I'm guessing there's a little bit of, you know, tension there. <laughs> Gotta love it. <laughs> Smells like Teen Spirit. Hey. Mystery Wreck. I'm guessing that's how you say it. Let me know. Welcome to the stream. Thank you so much for stopping by. Yes. Okay, the house is getting bigger now. Huh. Mom is starting to get nervous that Lonnie and Sam are hanging out every day. En español, por favor. Okay, so Janice got a new appointment at her job, so maybe that explains why she is not around. She went to go to her new job or something. Oh, I'm back over here now. Okay, now I know where this door leads to. Thank you. Did I do everything over there? I think I did. Wow, okay. This game's incredible. Uh, 
I'm getting creeped out every single step I take. Oh, Mr. Irek, awesome. Thank you. Yeah, thank you so much for being here. This is amazing. This has been my favorite stream this year for sure, for sure. So thank you so much, everybody, for making such a special time. This is a very special game to me. I promised I wouldn't cry, and I've already failed. You know, but we're all friends here. We all love each other here. We all spam the chat here. Wow, so this is like uh, they were making their own uh, comic book here. That's awesome. Look at Captain Allegra. Awesome. That's Sam. And then Lonnie is Rex. Rex one girl or something. I don't know. I can't read that. Oops. Someone's in trouble. Ooh, Sharpie. Or Galaxy. Gotta love GTs. Yeah, um, this game, how much, I think I've been streaming for an hour and a half. It's not going to be any more than three hours for the game. So, if you're back, you know, within that time, I should still be here, but, um... I may finish early, not sure. So just get back here as soon as possible, okay? <laughs> okay. Anything in here? No. What is that? Silver dollar? The gits. I'm assuming that's another band. <laughs> Sing it out. Sing it out and uh <laughs> All right. Uh Oh, here's another one. What is this? Rome? Okay, cool. See you in a bit. Oh, <laughs> Ninja Turtles. Wow. Barcelona, baby. Woo! Yeah, Europe is incredible. I've been to, personally, been to Paris. My god, it was an amazing experience. Just like everything is so old there. Yeah. Terrence is a frustrated writer for sure. That's too bad. Writing is hard, y'all. Where's the lights? Turn up the lights and now, baby. Extra bright. I want you to see all of this. Oh, I was over over here already. Was I? Oh, Barcelona. Okay. So you can see that as you progress through the house, um, it's all chronological. How you move through the house. And, you know, they won't, you know, step by step, they give you little pieces of information to extend the experience. There's Girl Scout again. Oh, last show ever. Okay. Wonder if I'm getting uh, an entry after this. Yep. Bonnie had her going away show with her band tonight. She's so incredible on stage. When she was singing, I could practically forget everything. That we only had 48 hours left. That I don't know what comes next. Oh my god. I live without her. Then she dedicated the last song to me. I couldn't take it. I was out on the curb in the alley, sobbing till my ribs hurt. I would follow her anywhere, Katie. But I can't. Where she's going. After a long time, she found me. She said she was sorry. She said, I wish things could be different. I just wanted to make you happy. I said, I don't think you can anymore. Oh my god. <sighs> oh, you guys.
Yes, Esh, clarify. Because the singing is obviously beautiful. That can't be it. I think he's just saddened by that scene. Scene, you know. Oh my god, I'm I'm like trying not to cry here. Heartache. I love how the the only conflict in the game you know it's not like the the only conflict in the game was yeah we're gay so of course you know they don't approve of us it's also like she's dealing with their their own regular romantic conflict you know that she's moving away tags I don't know if you're joking or not <laughs> I can't tell. Oh. Oh my god. Here we go. What's happening now? <laughs> okay, good. Just make <laughs> I just got to know. Together would be our happiest ever. And we'd forget tomorrow was going to come at all. It worked for a while. We had a good time seeing Oscar off, then ran up to the attic to look through our photos, to find one for Lonnie to take with her. And looking at them, I realized they were all in the past, and there wouldn't be any more. I didn't know what I was going to do, and I cried, and she held me. She said she knew it was hard, but life would move on. I said I didn't want my life to keep moving without her. That's when she cried too. I was so exhausted. I must have fallen asleep like that, in her arms. In the morning, I woke up, and I was finally alone. Oh, God. <sighs> Batmobile. Oh, Bratmobile. This is for you, Lonnie. Give me that paper. I think what I think is tags is a damn sweetheart. That's what I think. Damn sweetheart. That's right. Hiya! Alright, that's not doing anything. <laughs> Hashtag stop the bullying. Yes, exactly. Wow, that song is so good. Daniel finally came over to get his game. Uh oh. I'd been dreading it. Yes, I would too. this story with him that I wrote when we were little. I started reading it, and then there I was, crying at the kitchen table. He mm. asked what was wrong, and I was thinking about how we used to be friends, how much I take him for granted. But instead, I told him about school, and Dad, and Lonnie, and then how sorry I was that I wasn't his friend anymore. Wow. He gave me a hug and said it was going to be okay. But for some reason... I almost believed him. Oh my god. What is happening? <laughs> That's what I do when I go to people's houses. I just, you know, start cleaning out their fridge one thing at a time. <laughs> Break down the wall. Just let us love you. <laughs> the accidental pariah. It's always accidental. 
with Mr. Terrence. <laughs> I'm angry. They just left me here. What's going on? Where's my family? I'll make a mess till I find them. This is Lonnie's military hat. ROTC. Oh, man. I asked Lonnie what she had to do to get ready to ship out for basic training. She said, not a lot, really. You're not allowed to bring anything with you. You have no possessions. No contact with the outside world while you're in basic. You just train hard every day, and then you deploy from there. So, <laughs> they'll just send her away. To who knows where. The other side of the country. The other side of the world. My mind, like, can't process it. She's really going to be... gone. Just gone. Wow. So, here in the garbage, I found Sam's work uh, badge. Obviously, she's not going to work anymore, so uh, I'm starting to get the feeling that something really bad happened. Okay, all right, it's time for me to go back to the main room, I believe. Oh, I can see upstairs or downstairs, let's see. Okay, I'm still trying to get the attic to open. Is there a key? There's got to be a key for the attic somewhere. Oh god, I'm starting to get nervous now. Oh yeah, let's bring AIM up to speed, y'all. What do we see? Besides me crying again. Basically, if you weren't here for this, we found out that Lonnie has been training to go into basic uh, basic training. So, we're dealing right now with Samantha, or Sam. Oh, the slits! Yes! Good band. Um, Samantha's going to be moving away, or Lonnie's going to be moving away. So, they're saying their final goodbyes to each other right now. There's some room I missed there. Okay. Nope. Wrong way. Wow, thank you so much for joining me, everybody. Making this a hugely successful stream. This is incredible. I am beyond filled with joy that you would come here and share this amazing game with me. And so filled with love because you're all amazing, loving people. Um... You know, of course, it's, you know, you're my community. Of course, you would all be incredible and amazing. It's, it's... Oh, God, here we go. <laughs> Getting a little emotional here. But for real, it's just... What, what a wonderful thing that I was able to discover. Twitch through, you know, Cypher of Tear. You, you told me, yeah, you should be streaming. And that was, Tanya, the beginning of me actually streaming and starting to meet so many new people cool people and people that I call friends so thank you so much for joining me I I really do have a lot of love for you all gratitude thanks foolish you're amazing no chills just feels baby <laughs> oh yeah um, I used the key I, let me see. I think I... I used the key from the cabinet to open the basement. Oh, guest room. There's something... Oh, that's down... To, yeah, that's down to the basement. Okay. 
let me go down again. Whoop. Here. Yes, yes. I believe it's so. <clears throat> I know, this house is huge. It's a deal. Aha! <laughs> I love this set list. Todd's band lost their singer. Todd said he sucked. Lonnie said he got sick of Todd's shit. And he was complaining about needing a new singer. So Lonnie was like, I can sing. And they were all kind of like, you can? And she was like, probably. But <laughs> she's been rehearsing with them for like a week now. And I finally got to see them play in Todd's basement today. She's actually really amazing. I feel so proud when she's on stage. It's incredible being in awe of someone you love. So everybody knows it's like a temporary situation till she ships out in June. But till then, I'm going to be at every single show. Oh. Yeah, it's definitely like a not like a structurally sound house at all. Oh yeah. Oh, here we go. Another code. I bet you the key to the attic is in here. I wish I could continue hearing the music even if I go up. Oh. Okay, this is creepy. This is some MC Escher stuff here. What is going on? What? Grab toy. Get out of here, cat. My cat's actually on my lap right now, sleeping. Alright, I'm gonna have to go check to see if there's any other of those loose panels along the walls. Upstairs. Citizenship. Let's go upstairs. All right, it seems like we are nearing the end. I think I just need to find that last combination in that safe. I will most likely find the key to the addict. And like this note says, watch out for the addict. Don't go in the attic. What happened up there? What's going on? All right, see the map. All right, I feel like I already got these. 
You see that sometimes it kind of dead ends a little bit, and I'm not sure where to go after that. So I just want to check all of these spots one more time. Just to make sure I didn't miss anything. Hope you're all enjoying the stream so far. I knew that as soon as I heard this come to consoles, I knew I was going to stream it. So I, and I've been having a blast so far. So thank you everyone for making the time to spend some time with me today. Happy I'm okay day, everybody here. All right, Ash. Thank you so much for hanging out. I really appreciate it. Have a great day. Yes. Found it. Oh, oh God, here we go with the pentagram over here. Oh, boy. Is that Richard or Terrence? Oscar. Uncle Oscar. Oh, oh. Oh, God. The sunset light in this house is the saddest thing I've ever seen. I just want to sleep. When I'm in the attic, it almost feels like Lonnie could still be here. She's just downstairs. I'm just waiting to hear her pull down the hatch and come running up. Maybe I'll go up to the attic. And wait. Okay, everybody. I think this is it. I've got the attic key. You've heard the story, you've heard the dialogue. Lonnie's gone, Sam's not at work, parents are gone. What happened to my sister? We're about to find out right now. Thank you guys so much for being in this stream and sharing this moment with me. It's really special to me and I'm so glad I could share it with you. I know. Oh, God. What is that? What is that? God. Oh my God, Katie, I, I fell asleep in the attic, in Lonnie in my old spot, and I missed the first two calls. I just barely caught the third one before the machine got it, and it was Lonnie, on a payphone. She'd been on the bus to basic, and she said she couldn't... She couldn't think of anything but me, and us, and that she couldn't go through with it, with the army and being a part, and all of it. 
And so she got off the bus in Salem. She said, Sam, I want you to pack up everything you can and get in your car and come find me. And let's just drive until we find somewhere for us. And she asked me if I could do that. And I said, yes. Yes. <laughs> she said yes. <sighs> she said yes. Anything could have happened. She could have been hanging there. She could have overdosed, but she... She's safe now. She's happy. Katie, I'm so sorry. That I can't be there to see you in person. That I can't tell you all this myself. But I hope as you read this journal, and you think back, that you'll understand why I had to do what I did. And that you won't be sad, and you won't hate me, and you'll just know that I am where I need to be. I love you so much, Katie. I'll see you again, someday. <laughs> love. Both actresses were named Sarah, isn't that funny? Wow. Oh, this song is so good for the ending. <laughs> Too Gilpster, me too. It's just the music and the voice acting, everything is so perfect. It was so beautiful, I am so beautiful. Believe the hype. I'm so glad I didn't decide to have the cam on. <laughs> Ah, uh, you know what? Maybe I'll revisit this game. Next time I'll do it with the cam on. <laughs> so you can see me snot bubble cry. <laughs> wow. Thank you, Fulbright, for making this game. What an incredible game. <laughs> Foolish. Wow. Sam and Lonnie together forever. This is not my favorite romance story. Con home. Wow, everyone. Well, there you have it. That was Gone Home in its entirety and its amazement as brought to you by one of its biggest fans, most emotional fans. Thank you so much for bearing with me. 
Now spam, spam with love, please. Spam with love. I want to see all of the love. You have someone in your life you love, you tell them you love them, don't wait. Because you never know what's going to happen. <laughs> that would be a big fake out aim. <laughs> big, big fake out. Well, thank you all so, so, so much for joining me for the stream. Looks like we took a little under one hour, or a little under two hours. I saw what was coming, like Gilbster, you, you saw what was coming, same thing. I, I saw what was coming and I still couldn't help myself but get emotional. Uh, Aim, I love you so much too. Thank you so much. Thank you all for being here. Thank you all for spamming with love. Thank you for following. Thank you for hosting. You know, so happy to have met you all. I'm shaking right now. I can't believe I'm shaking right now with with this game, but also just with all the love I have personally in my life. We all have times where we're so down and we think it's all over for us. You just got to remember there's someone there that loves you. Just uh, be awake when the phone rings, yeah? <laughs> so much love, so much love. That's what this game's all about. That's what I'm all about. That's what all of you are all about. So thank you for being my great, amazing friends. Thank you for being amazing friends to each other. Yes, always keep positive. Always stay positive. We're a community now. We all must take care of each other. Let's continue to support each other always in everything that we do. I'll, I'm forever indebted to this family that I was able to find here. I owe you all so much. We are forever indebted to each other. That's what family is. That's what love is. Unconditional. Thank you so much, everybody. This has been Gone Home. I'll catch you all next time. Thank you so much for watching. You have no idea what this meant to me. So much love. I love you all. And as my favorite drag queen says, RuPaul, if you can't love yourself, how the hell are you going to love anyone else? Can I get an amen? Amen. Love yourself. Love yourself always. Always. Thank you so much for watching, everybody. I'm always here for you when you need. You just send me a message. I'll be, I'll be there. I'll be there. I'll be there. Just call my name and I'll be there. All right, y'all. I'm going to stop gushing. <laughs> this seems to be what I do best, but we'll, uh, we'll end the stream here. I'm going to put this up on YouTube later on so you can all have me forever on the internet. <laughs> it's not bubble crying. <laughs> but thank you so much for joining me. This is amazing, and, and I can't wait to catch y'all next time. Much love. Love yourself, love each other. All you need is love. <laughs> Thank you all. <laughs>